Let's talk about cancellation fees, meetings and reports, training and timing of plan reassessments. Our cancellation fees are consistent with the NDIS pricing arrangements guide. So you will be charged for all the support hours scheduled if you do not show up for a plan support arrangement or you are not home when the support worker arrives. Please let us know if you're late but are intending to meet your support worker. Or you have not given home place more than seven days notice of the support to be cancelled. If you and or your representative want to meet regularly with your senior coordinator or senior support worker to discuss your support either via telephone or face-to-face, -face, we may need to charge you for their time. This will be charged at the standard rate for the time of day these meetings will be held. If you require a senior coordinator or a senior support worker to support you to an appointment or an NDIA plan review, we will charge you for their time as well. You, your support coordinator or the NDIA may request reports from us from time to time. Time to write these reports will be charged as non-face-to-face -face supports, as in the NDIS Pricing Arrangements Guide. Training of staff that is specific to you and your disability or health needs will be invoiced. Examples of this include gastrostomy tube feeding, a positive behaviour support plan, a PBSP, an oral eating and drinking care plan, or an OEDCP, Continuous Positive Airway Pressure or CPAP, CPAP. Manual handling requirements that are specific to your mobility and assistance needs. This will be discussed with you and will be in your quote. You are financially responsible for ensuring these supports are paid.